G'day everybody, it is the Captain here. Welcome back to the channel. Hey, uh, before we get underway, big shout out to my mate, uh, Degeneration Nation. Make sure you're following his channel on YouTube. I will put a link to his channel in the description below. He is absolutely fantastic at knocking down frauditors and uh, softards all on his channel as well. So I will leave the details for you to check him out. Uh, this video comes in again from our mate, Bill. I tell you what, Bill, I'm gonna have to send you the therapy bills for this mate because after this video I needed to go to counseling dead set I almost had to find religion just to get me through this one uh we'll give you the quick rundown of it this this stupid frauditor decides to rock up to a local council's office and you can tell straight away from the video this dick knuckle is up to no good so let's just jump straight into it bear with me here we go Hello. I'm just taking some pictures. Oh, sorry. Just the building. Oh, anything that comes. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll come around. Okay. Oh, so we're off to a good start straight away. Pervy Pete here has decided that it's a great idea to stick his camera straight in through someone's window and he's having a bit of a gawk. And of course, straight away, you can tell that these employees are like, oh shit, it's a frauditor. It has to be a frauditor. Why did they have to come here? Oh no, oh no. Oh, they're in public, I mean, they're visible from public. No, They've yeah, got no... You're going right up to the window and you're taking photos. So can I see please what you've mm -hmm. taken? You, no, that's not... You can't no. take people, photos of people without their permission. In public? This isn't there's no, ex that, that's there's no public expect... Place. That is an office building. That's but the visible hours in public. Oh my God. Butt plug Brett. Listen to me very, very carefully. All because you can see something from a public area doesn't mean that you can go and stick your head straight in there. I mean, what's stopping people from filming, you know, the toilets, the public toilets, all that sort of stuff. In fact, what's stopping me from coming around to your house with my tripod, with me lights, with a full, you know, special effects crew so we can film you pulling your tiny little pod to whatever bullcrap magazine that you got in the mail, right? Would you like that? I'm happy to come around. I've got the setup. I've got the good sound equipment. Oh, come on over. All right, you pull down your pants and we'll start filming. Anything that I can no, see from public? No. I can, can show you, you the law? Can you please show me the photos? I, no, that's my personal that's business. Cool. Yeah. So. Yeah, okay. Thank you. Can you wait yeah. here, please? Okay. Thank you. You want to yeah. take a seat, that's fine. Okay. I'll just, I just want to have another look around. It's a beautiful building you have here. You have, you're mistaken that... No, um, I'm not. So there's no expectation of privacy in public? No, so sorry. They're all visible from public? Yeah, but you cannot go straight up and take photos of people without... Oh, they, can, they can put curtains there if they don't want to be seen from public. No, that's it's not, not my. It's not no, my not problem. Right. It's not... Yeah, No, sorry. you should not be taking photos of people without their consent. She's spot on. Surveillance Device Act states very, very quick, uh, clearly that you can't film or audio record anyone's private activity or conversation in a public place. That's the Surveillance Device Act. I didn't write it, but I know it because unlike this you know, fuckwit, I've managed to do my research before I go off spouting me mouth. Unlike uh, old uh, Cockbreath uh, uh, Connor over here, he's got no idea about any of this. So, look, if you're watching this Cockbreath Connor, have a read. Oh. Well, same you, as at Disneyland. Please, can you please have a seat while we uh, we'll sort yeah, this okay. out? Okay. I'm just going to do a loop around quickly and I'll be back. I'll, I'll be right back. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. I'm what, what did you want me to wait for? Because we're just, we're making a phone call at the moment just okay. to see. So what do you reckon? Do you reckon Fuck Knuckle No Friends is going to hang around and do exactly what he's been instructed to very nicely by this lady? Or do you think he's going to be an absolute frauditor and then go off and mess up other people's days? Oh, jeez, it's a tough call, isn't it? It's like asking you, do you think a fish enjoys being in water or in the desert? We just know the answer, don't we? Please do not take photos of inside this building. Um, you, I, you can ask me, but I can respectfully decline. Okay, so They're we're going to get our local laws department to come out okay. and have a chat, and then we'll okay. go from there, okay? Thank you. Yeah, you're mistaken, sir. Well, we don't want, you're not you can, they can pull the curtains down. Building. They can pull the curtains down, okay? Right. It's not my problem. If they're visible from public, 
You can't so trespass. Can your house and take photos this is not your house. This is a public building. It's, this is an office doing site here. It's public. Me, it's you're it's public. Feel very uncomfortable. So what? I suggest you walk away. I'm making people feel uncomfortable. Yes, well, that's that's not my intention, sir. I'm just well, taking. Well, you need to walk away then. Can you just calm down, please? No, no, Don't no, scream. You need to walk away, please. No, I'm not walking anywhere. There's a, there's a full office of very unhappy people right now. You're Why are they unhappy? Us, feeling uncomfortable. We're trying to work and do our jobs. You're distracting us and preventing us from doing so. Well, if their feelings are getting in the way of their so uh, work What's levels, it's not my problem. Are you a subcontractor? Well, you're making you it our problem because the windows are blocked out for a reason so we can do our work. You're pushed right up against the windows looking in at us. How would you feel if we came oh. around and did that to your house? This is not your house. This what, is a public what building. Are you doing it doesn't here? make what what is the purpose of you filming? Oh, 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 I can answer this. He went to YouTube University, got his degree on how to be an absolute dipshit in public, took that degree, went down the street, bought himself whatever little camera he's got, ran straight down to your office and said, Check it out! I've got a degree in being a dipshit. Do you like my certificate? <laughs> If if it's I, there's no I'll expectation the of privacy in public, it's you understand public. that? I, I'm standing in public, yeah. so anyone that you can, walks, you can record me right now. Yeah. So anyone that can't. anyone that walks here, yes. they can see those Correct. people. So there's see. no expectation of privacy in public. You understand that? That's the law. It's Victorian state law. It's also international okay. law. Well, we'll Now, that's not fair to put the whole blame on America. I mean, yeah, you guys came up with the whole uh, First Amendment auditor stuff, but probably not fair to put it all on you. I'm sure we're to blame as well. Can I get your name, sir? Yeah, my name's Alex. Alex? And what's your position here? I am a worker inside the building. The worker? Yeah. What, what, what's your position? Just if I want to make complaints, I just want to have uh, you, you guys' name. The front yeah, but if I don't have your name, I can't make a complaint. Can you I get your name, sir? So you've got it all on camera. What, am I going to show you your face? And then, is that professional or isn't it? You're a public servant, shouldn't you I be? I really don't know what you're at, mate. I really don't know what you're at here. What am I'm, I'm at? You're at something. Look, to be honest, I wouldn't uh, argue with old mate here. I mean, it is good practice not to argue with an Irishman, a Scotsman, or a Welshman. It's just, uh, it's just not smart. One, you're not going to understand the end, of the end of the argument. And two, they're going to have some really cool wisdom to throw on you that's going to make you question your entire existence. So it's just best not to argue. And no, no, they don't need to identify themselves to you at all. Okay, like, so can I get your last name? No. No. You're a public servant, you're refusing to give me your but name. But you're, you're not here position. doing anything to do yeah. with the council. I pay for this building, I'm a public... Of people inside an I'm a member of the public. I'm not a customer. To do anything. I'm a member of the public. You're being a nuisance. <laughs> Let me translate that to anyone that can't understand his accent. Pretty much what he's saying is he says nuisance, which actually means fully fledged fuckface. Uh, listen, mate, the best part of you honestly shot straight across your mum's back ended up being a stain on the curtain that the cat ended up licking off. Dead set, you got cheated. I'm not the one that's behaving in an odd manner. Yeah, mate, odd manner? Taking pictures is odd. Hey, God, mate. My name's Oliver. I'm the team leader of Wars. Yeah. I ask why you're filming. Please. I'm just taking pictures, mate. Sorry. Why are you taking photos? Just to take pictures. Mm. Can I get your last name, please? Yeah, my name's Oliver Young. I'm the team leader of Oak Laws. So Lo what's local laws? One of the departments here with a myriad of different areas. Okay. Can I ask why you're filming? Just to take pictures, mate. Just to take pictures? Yes. Are you able to do that in another location, please? At another location? Yep. Away from council, well, please. I'm, I'm in public here. It's fine. No. So, are you, currently, are you currently recording me? I am. All right, animal molester, Mike, let me break things down for you. The Local Government Act of 1989 allows the councils to appoint local law officers or local law enforcement and these guys have really really strong powers in fact they have the full weight of the council behind them in their decisions uh, they can detain you they can fine you uh, and you have to identify yourself to them if they require you to otherwise you are committing an offense these guys have very very good powers within inside their local governments and it's best not to fuck with them take pictures what was your name please sir i don't give my name mate. okay 
Are you aware that it is an offence to not provide your name when I request it under the law? What, are you a police officer? No, I have the authorisation to do that. My name's all of you. I've already told you that. Can I get your name, please, sir? It's an offence if I don't give you my name. No, I've got the ability to ask your name. And you're not even a police officer? Correct, I have the authorisation to do that. Can I please get your name, sir? Is that under threat of arrest? You want my name or? Not threat of arrest. It is an offence. If if it is an offence for not doing it, sir. It is an offence, or will you, will you arrest me? It is. I'm not going to arrest you. It's an offence for, for you to fail to provide the name. I'm sorry, sir. I... Uh, I want to keep okay. my I, I want to keep my privacy. I'm not doing anything wrong. Yeah, you heard him, right? Alex from Bang Homes Victoria likes his privacy. That's right. Alex from Bang Homes Victoria loves his privacy. So you listen here, local law enforcement officer. You leave Alex from Bang Homes Victoria alone. He but likes his privacy, and I think we deserve to give him his privacy. So never ever bother Alex. Ever, ever again, even if he's from Bang Home, Victoria, right? You just leave him alone. Poor old Alex loves his privacy. I think we've all covered that now, haven't we? All right, Alex, we'll leave you alone. Just, mate. Just to take pictures? Yes. Why have you decided just to take pictures of this location? It's not just this location. I take pictures everywhere. Why? It's a very interesting building. It's beautiful. Okay. We have a lot more interesting buildings in this municipality than here. Can you please see? Which Can ones? Please? Can you please leave? No. I'm not doing nothing wrong, mate. I'm just taking pictures. I'm not going to leave. No, you, you are going up to... It's the report you're going up to... Up to windows. I'm allowed to go Video to the... Win- the public is allowed to walk past those windows and look inside. You're that means that I can take sir. pictures in there. You are recording? I, I'm going to ask you again to leave. Recording is taking pictures. Unfortunately, the same thing. If, you, if you do refuse to leave, I will have to get the uh, police to come down. You can do whatever you want, sir. I'm not doing anything wrong. I'm not breaking any law. I will, I will advise you to think carefully. You can agree to disagree with that. That's you, fine. I will advise you to think carefully before you call law enforcement I'm for law somebody. Enforcement. Listen. I will advise you very carefully before you call law enforcement to think if I'm breaking any law. Yeah. Now, a member of the public is allowed to stand right there and they can look in those windows. That means I can take sir. pictures. You're taking photos and you're taking video. You are making people uncomfortable as well as. Making people uncomfortable is not a crime, sir. It is inappropriate behaviour. Inappropriate? Inappropriate to who? That's your opinion. No, under other... All right, this goes on for some time. They go round and round and round and round in circles. He's pulling the full, full-fledged full First Amendment order to bullshit that you'd find in the United States. It's not even quoting anything to do with the local laws or Australian laws. He's quoting the UN Charter at one stage. He's going on about bloody trespass and how he's got the right to just film wherever he wants. And all because he can see it from a public area, it gives him full right to do so. Listen here, Camel fucking Cameron, it is a good idea not to do any of these things and just listen to what you've been instructed to do. They're asking you just to fuck off. They're not asking you to go off to war. They're asking you just to fuck off. Just, just go away. Let us do our job and we'll fucking leave you be. And I tell you what, he goes, yeah, yeah, no worries. And what's he do? You just saw, he's straight back at it the second they go inside. Like a proper frauditor, he agreed to one thing, turned his back and did something else. Hey, go, Mike, good, thanks. No, not much. Any reason why you're coming, or? Oh, just to take some pictures. Oh, why? Yeah. Just to take pictures, yeah. Okay. Can you just stay two metres, please, COVID and stuff? Yeah, yeah. It's a bit uncomfortable when, when you're filming people, we're not sure what you're, what you're doing. Yeah, there's no expectation of privacy in public. It's a public building, I'm in public. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Do you want to tell me why you're filming or...? Just to take pictures, I've already told you. Okay, no problem. Oh my god, it's a public building, I'm in public, there's public around, there's public this, there's public that. I'm going to go off to the public toilets and, and pull my little penis until the police come and say, hey, you probably shouldn't be pulling my little penis here in the public. But I like the words beginning with P, so I'm going to be peeing myself while playing with my penis in front of the public. Yeah. Anyway, he fucks off to the car park for some reason. Mostly because he thinks it's a great idea to film uh, their number plates. Because that's exactly what the council officers really, really want. They want you filming not only them in their workplace, but their private vehicles to put up on the internet. And ladies and gentlemen of the jury, he actually did that. Their number plates were plastered all over his channel. I'm not an arsehole, so I'm going to blur out their fucking number plates 
uh, for their privacy. I don't care about his, I care about theirs. What's all the commotion for a few pictures? Comfort levels. Hmm? Comfort level. No, I'm just curious as to why you're taking pictures. Well, I just, I already told like 10 people that I'm taking pictures. I take pictures. It's just a bit unusual, that's all. So you can understand why we're a bit, what's he doing, you know? Taking photos inside? I guess I can understand, but to, you know, to make all that commotion and stuff, calling the cops, it's pretty crazy. Yeah, we don't get, we don't often get people taking photos inside the building. That's a shame, that's mm. a shame. Mm. Yeah, ding me, you hello. Waiting? waiting for the police, are you? Well, I don't want the police chasing me. How you going, mate? Hi, good. Good this recording? Is, is yes, I am. What for? Oh, just for myself, yeah, just take some pictures and stuff. Yeah, that's a bit unusual around the council building. There's laws that probably prevent that. And suspicious behaviour around our building is a health and safety. Suspicion issue. is a crime or? It, it's concerning for us because we don't know what your motives are. We don't know what who you are and why you're doing this. This is unusual behaviour. So, you know, we have every right to protect our staff and our right. buildings and that. Yeah. So Well, there's about 15 cameras in that building. They're constantly on videotape. I don't know why yeah. they're feeling uncomfortable or you, you feel threatened. We don't, we don't know what your intentions are and why you're here videotaping. With the pictures. Staff. Yeah, but why? It's unusual behaviour, wouldn't you agree? So it, no, it, it, not at all. I'm uh, in public, I'm allowed to take pictures. Uh, you stop. I'm going to politely decline you, yeah, I'm in oh. public. That would, be, that would be violating my rights. Well, we'll, we'll Victorian we'll, state law says I can record in public. We'll get the police here too. Okay, I mean you can do whatever you want. Yeah, but, we will yeah. do that because we, we take staff security and the security of our building and our assets. This is a serious thing. Uh, we don't know your intentions or whatnot, and that's why we'll take this action. Yep. Okay. But I've asked you to stop recording. Yeah, I'm not going to stop recording. Absolutely not. Yeah. And, and, and there you won't be violating my rights is today. Is there any reason that you you are recording? I'll just take some pictures. I've already said it about 15 times now. So, but what are you taking pictures of? Just to take pictures so of just, the whole building, including staff. Well, absolutely. They're public servants. Absolutely, they're in public. So when you go to Disneyland and you take a picture of your kids, do you ask the 4,000 people behind you to, for permission? Slightly different. Slightly different. Why? It's both it's public. A very different context, isn't it? Why? Because they're, they're taking holiday photos or whatever they're doing. They're not hanging around a public building. I'm not hanging around. I've been here. For, I was here for three minutes until yeah. you guys video, said you're calling the cops on me. Going up to windows and filming inside of the building. Oh. It's, on, it's public property. I'm on See, public that's property. Not normal behavior. It's not normal no, behavior. It's not. No, it's not. Again, this goes on for some time, uh, going around and around in circles, round and round in circles. This guy is one of the, the main people that work at the council. He's come out just to try and just to be, you know, reasonable with, uh, with him. But everyone knows you can't be reasonable with frauditors because they don't understand reasons. They don't understand logic. These people are missing a chromosome somewhere or they're missing some part of their gene that makes them normal. And they've all of a sudden just gone absolutely burko. They drink this uh, this bloody Kool-Aid of First Amendment stuff and blah, blah, blah. And again, he's not even worried about the First Amendment of the United States. He's worried about the goddamn UN Charter. He's even got a GoFundMe page set up because out of all the videos he's got on his channel, and he has five, Four of them are him being arrested. Yeah, five videos, four of them of him being arrested because he is a dead set flog on society. So, donkey fucker Daniel here, you deserve everything that is coming your way. And I mean everything, right? You just, you just deserve everything that comes your way. Hello, how are you going? Good, Good thanks. Yes. Can I just get your name and badge number, please? My name's Holly Fogarty, first principal for Fort Nine Thank you. And your name and badge number, sir? What's your name, man? I, I said it's Alex. Yeah, Can you, you, your surname? I haven't given it. Can I just get your name and badge number, please? What are you doing here today? Is it not professional for you to give me your name and badge number, sir, if you're communicating with me? I haven't got your details yet. So if you give me I mean, your I'm not a public servant. You should be. Is it not professional for you to give me? What are you me? doing here today, Alex? I'm just taking some pictures. Can you just? Can I get your name and badge number, sir? Unless we're executing legislation, we don't have to give you our name or badge number. Take that, bitch! Oh, you're dead. I've read your policy. You, if you're communicating yeah, with the public. What the moment is, 
just Alex, I need you to look at me and listen to me for a second, okay? okay? You're trespassing at the moment, okay? Staff have asked you to leave, okay? We have legislation, if you don't provide us your name and address, you will be placed under arrest. Do you understand that? Okay, just going to run a quick poll. Who thinks he complies and who thinks he's about to play the game? Fuck around and find out because we know that the soft tarts love playing that game and it turns out Aussie Forditors love playing it as well. So get your votes in. Does he comply? He goes, absolutely, here's my license. Or is it? Fuck around and find out. Uh, they can't ask me to leave for any reason. They're, they're violating leave. my rights. Listen to me for a second. Yes. I've asked you to leave, okay? For what reason? The staff have asked you to leave because you're in here trespassing at the moment, okay? You're filming? I understand that's fine. You're allowed yeah. to film, okay? Staff have asked you to leave. You haven't left. Well, they've asked okay. me because I'm filming. Well, no shit. So, leave. at the moment, we've asked you to leave. Are you going to leave? Um, I mean, I, am I going to get a trespass notice? Because I'm going to sue you guys. That's I mean, right. you have no right to kick me out. They have I'm no right you, to ask me Alex, to leave. I'm telling you, you need to leave. Are you going to leave? Are you going to give me a trespass notice? I'm telling you right now, are you going to leave? All right, leave? we'll stand outside then. I'll, I'll talk Hi. to you there. Oh, you don't want me to leave now? Alex, yep. I need your details. What is your last name? Uh, yeah, Doctor, it's, uh, it's the captain again. Yeah, no, I've had to watch the video again. Yeah, no, in the fetal position this time. Yeah, rocking back and forth, that's right. Nut, nut thumb was in my mouth, I have to admit. Can you see me on Tuesday? It's an emergency. I've had to watch this stupid forwarded a video again. For trespass? Correct. If you refuse so, to give your details, you'll be placed under arrest. So, I, I'm you are argue. demanding me I'm to give you my argue. name Correct. for a crime of trespass. Are you for the crime of trespass, correct? correct? Can you just answer my question? So, I yes. answered your okay. questions. So, right after I give you my ID... It is time once again, ladies and gentlemen, to play the game, uh, fuck around, and find out! Officers, take it away! Will I receive a trespass notice? Receive a I may. Trespass. Is that likely? I have to speak to staff. Okay. I mean, I, moment, I may you? is not really a, a, a suspicion of a no. crime. It's a may. I don't have to clarify that with you. I need is it likely? Know. Alex, I'm not going around in circles but, with you. But you, okay? you, you got to ask for my name for a crime, you and you're saying maybe now? it's a crime. Okay, we're giving Simple you ample opportunity to provide your details. You can be placed under arrest now if you don't provide them. So for a maybe crime, you're going to arrest me because I'm not giving my name. Okay. Is that right? All right. Arrest me. Oh, there's no sweeter sound than listening to a frauder or a subtard get arrested. I tell you what, I live for it. I dream for it. I wake up in the morning and I pray to everyone that will listen. Please, please give me a frauder to getting arrested. It's just the only way I'm going to get through my day. I'm now actually in a subtard frauder uh, anonymous group where I just go in there and I go, it's been two days since I've watched a frauder video. Uh, and then everyone else tells me their stories. And, uh, you know, that's kind of how it happens. Anyway, there it is. As I told you, this guy has been arrested. Four out of five videos that he has put on his channel. And I'm not even going to tell you what his channel name is because he doesn't deserve shit. Him and his 400 subscribers can just suck each other off as far as I'm concerned because there is no way knowing that this guy deserves any more of our time. However, if you do want to see more of the videos of him being arrested, let me know in the comments below and I will do my best to bring that on uh, to this channel and uh, also please again a big thank you to each and every one of you that do like subscribe and share these videos with your friends I love you guys I do very very much anyway until next time hey Rue good night see you later alright yeah okay I'll see myself out Jesus <laughs>